Um, with major modernization programs, what you want to do is actually we want to bring additional capabilities to a system. Uh, this is exactly what we have done to our MLRS platform, which is a combat proven platform. And what we've done right now is uh, uh, bring additional level of protection equivalent to that of the HIMARS, which is actually out there protecting our soldiers and, and, and providing uh, support to the warfighter. The, the, num the number uh, to be shot is, is equivalent to that of, of a normal um, high op tempo uh, operation. And, it, and, the, and the vehicle, the platform is supposed to be able to prove out the capability and ensure that the new upgrades and new modernizations have not degraded that uh, operational capability. Exactly, exactly. That's the, that's the primary intent is to, to be able to prove out the, the system through the stressors of, that, uh, of the firing that a typical rocket will put the platform through. White Sands offers us an, uh, uh, an opportunity to really, really stress the, the, the system. It, 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 is a very, uh, it is a very rough environment. Uh, to test and it, it, when you're able to effectively get the, the, uh, the hours or get the assessment that you need in an environment like this, um, we, we feel very confident that the system is in fact ready uh, to meet its wartime mission. I think it's different in the aspect that we're getting our hands on something before everybody else is. We're going to get an opportunity to pass some of this information on to uh, some of our counterparts in the rear. And as opposed to our normal training, I would have to say that we're doing a lot more consistent fires and really pushing the limits of what these launchers can do and giving them an opportunity to really, giving us an opportunity to really see how far we can go with this system before it starts shutting down. White Sands is very unique in the size and availability of range space as well as airspace. And then uh, specific to these type of tests, we have these large impact areas. Well, the, the MLRS program in general has a, has a long history with White Sands. We've been testing with them essentially since their beginning. And uh, we, we've continued to provide them you know, the, the support they need to do uh, these new system tests as well as launcher tests. Uh, we, we did actually have to do a lot of cleanup in this impact area. Um, these impact areas are designed, uh, you know, as, they, as they're stated, for impacts. And so when we do maneuvers, we do have to remove a lot of infrastructure for that. Well, because the troops need to be able to maneuver. And so these areas are, are ideal for that since uh, they got a lot of real estate that they can use um, to maneuver in.